Hi, today I want to show you how I run the scrolling text on my Twingly LED light. I have another video showing how to hang the light on the wall using a cargo net. You can check out this video. My program is written in Processing. You can download the IDE from the website processing.org. I've been using this for a while. I have also another video showing how to write the program directly on an Android phone. I have already downloaded. I'm using the version 3.54. Here is the microscopic version number. I will also make my program available for download. It's a very simple program. Initially, I have written this uh, for my time box. I've got another video as well scrolling the text on the time box. Here is my program. First of all, you need to find out your IP address. You have to go to the devices and uh, go to the key view and here is the IP address. One important thing is uh, after you mapping the light, make sure you close the Twingly app before you run this program. So the first thing you need to do is enter your IP address here. The next thing is uh, you have to define the screen size. I put it as 14 times 6. Uh, it must be at least 6 because the phone uh, running through is 6 pixels high. And the next one is just enter the text here. I put some space at the end just make sure the text is pushed out before it restart. For the demonstration, I'm going to change the text by comment this out and take the next line. Now run it. For some reason, it's flashing at the beginning. I don't know why. And here you can see uh, these are the number of frames uploaded to the Twingly Lights. The longer the text is, the more frames it is required. I hope you can read what I have written here. And there, uh, I just want to give you a small look into the program. I don't want to explain everything here. Here you can change the delay and if I make it smaller, the text should be faster. Now it's much faster. Okay, you have to play around to get the optimum speed. And here is also uh, where I define the color. Uh, you can change it a little bit because uh, I'm trying to do the a kind of steps to put into the RGB color and do it randomly. I don't want to go to the details. You can have a look and adjust the color here. If you put the value higher, the, in general, the color should be brighter. I'm putting the random color for each character. So I think that's all about it. Uh, at the moment, I know the program is really bad. There's no user interface at all. I don't want to delay my video because uh, Christmas is almost there. All of you can try maybe and give me some feedback. Of course, you are doing this at your own risk. I have done this based on some uh, internet research and I don't know what can happen with other lights. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like this video, please give me a thumb up. Thank you for watching and Merry Christmas. Bye.